The benches are deliberately designed very simple. They are not elaborate. They were all manufactured in New Zealand with the local hardware, then shipped over here. That's another kind of simple aspect of the temple. I have tried to keep everything very, very simple. The dome itself is just very simple white against the very green of, of the hill. You know, the idea of simplicity has always been there. It comes from the way the Samoans are and they live. The dedication takes place in the presence of many Baha'is and invited guests. I am further moved to express our gratitude to the supreme body of Baha'i faith, the Universal House of Justice, for choosing Western Samoa to be the recipient of such a gift. My sincere and warmest expression of thanks goes to the members of the Baha'i faith all over the world, both high and low, who have given so generously of their resources. But I want to tell you something that uh, I really felt I am in family. From the very first day here, all the Baha'is here, they considered me, I felt that, as a part of the family, like a brother or sister. And I have always been feeling that way. When I'm in Samoa, I feel I'm in a second home. occasion, especially for the 20th year of this temple. I was very happy to look at the temple and to see that it has stayed just about new <laughs> and it hasn't really deteriorated as such. They have looked after it very well and it had aged very well. The lava stones at the entry to the basement. They are from Sabai. 